The Drexel family says that their love for Brittany Drexel will outweigh the hate they have for Raymond Moody on the day that Moody pled guilty to murdering Drexel in court. The defendant took so much more away from us than just Britain. Everyone here is affected by that because of the choices you made. A grieving family from New York. My heart is broken. My life forever changed. So many lives destroyed by your selfish actions. Coming to the low country on Wednesday, finally getting closure after 13 long years. Raymond Moody kidnapped and raped Brittany Drexel before killing her and burying her body at a Georgetown County campsite in 2009. Oh, monster. No, I took Brittany Drexel's life. The 15th Circuit Solicitor's Office says that advances in technology were key in finally pinning Moody, who had long been a person of interest in the case. They were able to pick a very narrow, less than a minute time frame that something happened to her. The family of Timothy Taylor, who was previously identified as a suspect in the Drexel case, is glad that his name is finally clear, but that the years of false accusations cause irreversible damage. Will we ever see accountability, justice? I'm left with that question today. For the Drexel family, healing means working every day in their daughter's memory. Brittany's life and memory are now the driving force behind the initiative to make changes in sex offender laws. Drexel's mother Dawn says that this is far from over and she is thankful for the law enforcement who made this day possible. Reporting in Georgetown, I'm Forrest Tucker. Count on two.